Good morning, Trojans and Lions. Today is Monday, making it a marvelous Monday. And we're gonna go ahead and read the story, Let's Go Froggy. This story is written by Jonathan London and it's illustrated by Frank Remkes. So let's go ahead and take a look what this is all about. I know we previously read a story about Froggy, right? And what was it about? Do you guys remember the other story about Froggy? Yeah, it was about Froggy learning to swim and he was able to try something new. So let's take a look at what Let's Go Froggy is all about. Let's Go Froggy. It was warm. Froggy woke up and looked out the window. Birds, butterflies, flowers. Hooray, sang Froggy. I want to go out and play. Okay, said his father. How about a bike trip and a picnic? Would you like that? So it sounds like Froggy's gonna get a chance to go outside in the great day. Yes, cried Froggy, let's go. First you have to get ready, silly, said his father. Okay, said Froggy, I'm getting ready. Do your parents tell you to get ready every time you go somewhere? I know, we do. We always take, tell Kaylee, all right, let's get ready. Froggy, called his father, let's go. I'm ready, yelled Froggy, and flopped out to show him. Flop, flop, flop. But Froggy, said his father, you need your bicycle helmet. I don't know where it is, said Froggy. It's wherever you left it. I forgot. You have to look for it. Why do you think he needs a bicycle helmet? Hmm. Yes, so he can be safe, right? We need to be safe at all times. Froggy, called his father, let's go. I'm ready, yelled Froggy. Flop, flop, flop. Do you think he's really ready? You should bring your butterfly net, said his father. I don't know where it is. It's wherever you left it. Oh man, it sounds like Froggy doesn't really remember where he leaves his things, huh? Oh, that Froggy. Let's see what he does next. So Froggy looked for it. His butterfly net. Flop, flop, flop. He looked under the coffee table. Bonk. He looked in the garbage can. Slam. You think he found it? He looked in his father's golf bag. I found it, yelled Froggy, and swung it at a fly. Swish! But missed. Lucky fly, huh? He got away. But what did he hit instead? Oh my gosh, the coffee! Froggy! yelled his father. I'm ready, yelled Froggy. Flop, flop, flop. How about the ball grandpa gave you? Asked his father. Ah, I don't know where it is. It's wherever you left it. Do you think he really knows where he left it? No, he doesn't probably. Let's see where he looks. So Froggy looked for his ball. Flop, flop, flop. He looked under the stove. 
bonk. He looked in the cookie jar. Slam. He looked in the bathtub. I found it, he yelled, and kicked it into the goldfish bowl. Splash. Are all his items in the spots they're supposed to be? Hmm. It doesn't seem like it. Does that remind you of someone or something? Froggy called his father. Let's go. I'm ready, yelled Froggy. Flop, flop, flop. Let's bring the bag of peaches. Auntie Lolu gave you, said father. I don't know where it is. It's wherever you left it. Oh man, look at him thinking. Do you really think he knows where he left it? Probably not. Oh, that little froggy. So froggy looked for the bag of peaches. Flop, flop, flop. He looked under the kitchen table. Bonk. He looked in his closet. Slam. He looked in his bed. I found it, yelled Froggy, and took a bite. Scrunch. He was getting kind of hungry. Now it seems like he's finding all these things in random places. Froggy, called his father. Let's go. I'm ready, yelled Froggy. Flop, flop, flop. Daddy, can I bring that pack of trading cards? Uncle Gregor gave me. Okay, Froggy, but hurry, let's go. I don't know where it is. It's wherever you left it. Hmm. Are they ever going to get to go bike riding? Oops, here it is. I found it. It was in my pocket. Silly froggy. Can we go now, daddy? I'm ready. Okay, but do you know where my red backpack is? Asked his father. Daddy, it's wherever you left it. I forgot, froggy pointed. It's on your back. Froggy laughed. Oops, cried Froggy's father, looking more red in the face than green. Ready to go at last, Froggy flopped over to the bicycle. Flop, flop, flop. Let's go, Froggy, said his father. I'm hungry, said Froggy. I want to eat now. So they ate their picnic on the patio. Munch, scrunch, munch. Okay, I'm ready, said Froggy. Let's go, said his father. And off they pedaled into the sunset. Whee! Now that took a really long time for Froggy and his dad to get ready to go on their bicycle ride. Does anyone remember what time of day it was when they first wanted to go on the bicycle ride? That's right, it was morning time. So it took Froggy and his dad all day to get ready for them to go on their bike ride. I want you to think about a time now that you were gonna go somewhere and did it take you a long time to get ready or were you quick and did you know where everything was? Think about that. Does it take you a long time to get ready or do you, do you know where your stuff is and you get ready quickly? Well, go ahead and go to our Google Classroom and share on the comment section if it takes you a long time to get ready and why or if you get ready fast. All right, we'll see you later. Bye.